Rising AFL star Marley Williams has gone on trial accused of a revenge attack that broke a man's jaw. It's alleged the Collingwood defender punched a man outside an Albany nightclub. The Pies player arrives at Albany court. Inside, a jury heard Marley Williams doesn't dispute that he punched Matthew Robertson, fracturing the left side of his jaw. But he maintains he was defending himself. His lawyer, Tom Percy, said minutes earlier inside Albany nightclub Studio 146, his client was taunted and assaulted. When he went outside, the three men came at him and he hit Matthew Robertson. But Matthew Robertson said, while he remembers a bit of talk back and forth near the nightclub toilets, he denied denied a confrontation. Matthew Robertson told the jury outside the club he remembered speaking to his friends about getting a taxi and going home. Then he was suddenly punched. Prosecutor Tony Loudon said it was simply revenge. He said in an interview with police, Marley Williams said, I wasn't going to let them feel they got the better of me. The defence disputes Matthew Robertson suffered grievous bodily harm and said even if he did, the punch was still lawful because it was thrown in self-defence. Marley Williams has pleaded not guilty. Cecile O'Connor, Nine News. This trial is expected to last the week. Cecile O'Connor has details on the witnesses who will be called to give evidence. Well, the CCTV played today shows a number of people outside the nightclub when this incident occurred and also inside the club. The club's owner is seen in the CCTV footage. He'll be giving evidence along with a crowd controller. And, of course, Marley Williams did a recorded interview with police. That will also be played to the jury and there'll be evidence from uh, the police. Um, and there'll also be medical evidence. So the trial is expected to last about five days.